Art is too important not to share. Welcome to the Allie and Callie Artcast. Hi, I'm Allie. And I'm Callie, and we're with the Coeur d'Alene Arts and Culture Alliance. Hello, everyone. Hello, Callie. How's it going? Oh, good. Good. My house is back to normal. You uh, mean you have the house to yourself pretty much I now? I do, yes. I'm, I'm back to just myself and Stu on Saturdays. <laughs> <laughs> and um, I have Jackson in the basement, and uh, sometimes uh, we have Sayla, which I love. Oh, yeah, yes. that's awesome. And then now we're down to three dogs. Oh, that's nice. Yes. And no cats. No cats. Oh, man, that's yes. got to be Maddie nice. and Clay moved into their house. And I'm Yay. very happy, and they're very happy, and Yay. yes, everything all is well in the world. That's great. I clean my carpets. Oh, I wish I would, I would like to do that. Well, uh, but I have two dogs, and they're big and hairy and yeah. sometimes dirty, and yeah. I've kind of given up, given up on well. the carpets. I'm just going to replace them when they're gone. Oh, I know. Well, it, yeah. if you had seen them, you would have cleaned them. Oh. It was bad. I might have. Right. Okay. <laughs> Anyway. Anyway, how are you? Great. Tell me, you've got some news, don't I you? Do, and yes. it's okay to tell the news? Yes. Is it? Because uh, Did you get the okay? Not exactly. Okay, well they don't listen anyway, <laughs> I do know, they? No. Okay. So I think we're good. <laughs> <laughs> well, if they listen, then you get in trouble. You go, oops, I'm sorry. Well, you know, back in May, I found out that we're having another grandchild. Yes. And on Sunday, they had a little reveal, and it's a girl. Yay! Hendrix is having a little sister, I'm and is so he excited? excited? Not no. at all. Oh, well. <laughs> He'll get over it. He'll be excited eventually. Yeah, yeah. well, hopefully. Yeah. You should see the way he treats the little baby doll that my mom gave him oh, for that's right. Christmas. When is she due? January, the first week of January. Ooh, yeah, that's not that far away. I know. Ooh. I know. Three months, I think, is all we have to wait. How so. fun! I know. I'm really excited. Yay! I'm glad. One of each is always great. Yeah. We were just talking about. I know. The I had age my children babies. late in life, and I had them in my mid twenties. Yeah. So you know, and they all seem fine. Yeah. <laughs> Mine aren't too special. <laughs> Just kidding. I love you, Jackson. <laughs> he doesn't listen either, so right. it doesn't I really know, matter. So it doesn't matter. Anyway. I know. Well, well, we are here today to pay tribute to our very good friend, Roberta Larson. Yes. She passed away um, recently, and it was right after her 87th birthday, mm -hmm. which um, we all got to celebrate down at her place at Cougar Bay. But she's um, been such a mover and shaker in this community with re regards to art. And not only was she a mover and shaker, but she was a good friend. Yes. And, and boy, we've known her. I've known her 29 years, I yeah. think. Ever since I've been to Coeur I've mm -hmm. known her. But got to really know her when uh, she was on the board of the Arts and Culture Alliance. And actually, sh she started the arts and culture well, she, she with Steve Gibbs, correct? I think, no, I think she came but in she, a little bit later, but okay. she she definitely was a um, major player right. in the organization. So we'd like to welcome Ellen Travolta Hello. and Mary Sanderson Hello. and Ruth Pratt, who yes. were also good friends of Roberta's, and yes. we're just going to talk about Roberta today. So welcome, you guys. Yes. Thank you. Thank, thank you. Yeah. Um, I think I've known Roberta the longest. Probably. You have? Mm -hmm. I met her in nine. 1990, mm -hmm. wow. uh, the year the summer theater opened here at uh, this at uh, at the college. At the college, mm -hmm. and um, a couple of people from town were in the show, and they invited us over for Fourth of July, mm -hmm. and we went mm -hmm. to the first. What was it? Was it a pork? What, what, what did they used to call it? The oh, oh, it was, it was David's was lamb. Lamb. Roast. Lamb. They lamb, had the lamb yeah. roast. Yeah, that good. Mm -hmm. It's good to have yeah. young people. <laughs> You know, you're the youngest Mary Blank. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah. anyway, so I knew her uh, from there, and, and, and then we met on many different committees mm -hmm. um, uh, through the years, mm -hmm. served on different committees, and uh, also became closer and did the things together. We walked, I think, I don't know when you guys joined us, so we walked for a good 10 years, 15 mm -hmm. wow. years. I think we walked 
all of us mm-hmm. we did. for 10. So yeah, I think you, we started you, in 90, I don't know, 6, 7, whatever it was. It was a, a long time. So I've known her for a long time, and I have great memories of mm-hmm. Roberta. Um, but I'm not, I mean, I, just jump in. <laughs> just jump in because, you know, uh, I, I'll tell this one story, and then we'll go back to that. But and the, in, 19, in 20, uh, 2000, 2000, my family had Travolta Family Films, and I would f- travel around the country to places and have writers pitch stories to us to produce. Mm-hmm. And I was walking partner with Roberta, and one day I said, you know, Roberta, I'm going to Santa Fe. Mm-hmm. She said, yo, I said, yeah, they got a, I got a big house there, and I got everything taken care of. I said, do you, do you want to go? Mm-hmm. And she said yes, and then I thought, oh, man. I'm going to know everybody, and there's Roberta, and that, is it going to be hard? Yeah. Honey, nobody worked a room like Roberta. <laughs> <laughs> Boy, is that true? <laughs> we went to, we went to um, uh, oh gosh, it'll come back to me the name, We uh, Shirley MacLaine's house, and, mm-hmm. and there were all kinds of celebrities. She just had her glass of wine, she talked to, every day she'd walk the streets, went to the art museums, and we would get together at the end of the day because I had meetings on day. But she was a mm-hmm. wonderful traveler and a wonderful mm-hmm. social mixer. She knew how to be. Mm-hmm. I and, believe and, that. Yeah, she was very independent. Mm-hmm. Take it, girls. Well, I, was tra- <laughs> I was trying to remember how we got to know Roberta. We were talking about this. and. I, don't, I, I think the library, we were at the Library Foundation, mm-hmm. and somehow we started walking with you and Roberta, and I don't remember exactly how that came about. Ruth and I were friends, and... She invited you guys. She, she said, at first, I didn't come. like the idea. I know. <laughs> <laughs> well, darn. You just two, okay. it's nice, we fit yeah. in yeah. the side. <laughs> the yeah. side <laughs> I like that. Now we got two more. <laughs> got two more. What do you do with two more people? But, we, you know, we kind of got along, yes, and we, we did. moved, and we talked to different people and yeah we walked together in the morning at 7 a.m. for mm-hmm. probably 10 years, ten years. Mm-hmm. Ten years. I guess wow. they used to walk by my house really yeah, yeah. Wow. we yeah. walked different neighborhoods yeah, I'd see them around um, we'd walk different places and it was it was nice until we started doing more coffee than walking well we, we started we'd walk and have coffee once a week mm-hmm. and then we had coffee every day <laughs> after so many years and hardly walked <laughs> yeah, hardly right. yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that started in the winter, it seems like. Yeah. When, you know, we used to go down to the plaza mm-hmm. shops and do that. And, then yeah. we, we, and everybody traveled and stuff. Yeah. But yeah. certainly mm-hmm. spring to fall, we had a good time and lots of, and we took lots of trips. We took we some did. trips. We did. And a lot of them, thanks to you. So we should talk about some of those. Well, those, um, those were special. on my decade birthdays and mm-hmm. half decades, my lovely brother, John Travolta sends a small jet and a pilot and I can get to go wherever I want to go and I took my friends with me. Mm-hmm. So the first year we went Victoria. to Victoria. To Victoria. Nice. Ooh, fun. And that we stayed there. Did we stay there? No, we so came we, back. We, we just, just a day trip. Yeah, we it was a day, day trip. trip. We went and we stayed the day. We went early in the morning and stayed all the whole day. Mm-hmm. Yes. And that was, remember when Roberta did about the lady yes, with the roses? Yes, yes. What was, tell me the story. <laughs> oh, we went there were so many beautiful gardens there mm-hmm. and we were walking around it was a beautiful day I remember we we went to the Empress and then we went to that was it a miniature museum? We went yes. to the miniature yeah. museum, and yes. And then we were walking around and, and we came upon this lady who was working in her garden and it was gorgeous she was just obviously um very attentive and so we were all just standing at the fence there uh, admiring this garden and said how wonderful it was and roberta was also standing there and the woman was just like oh thank you thank you and roberta said you missed a dandelion over there (laughs) (laughs) this was her sense of humor well not so much appreciated by the lady who (laughs) the look on her face was just like, <laughs> yeah. yeah. But that was a fun trip. That was yeah. the first one. That was the first that one. Was our first. And then we went to Walla Walla. Yes, yep. we went to one Walla Walla. Time we did mm-hmm. that. Mm-hmm. Did yeah. you fly into Walla Walla? Yeah, uh-huh. we flew in oh, wow. yeah, we flew in right into 
where um, right Dunham, Dunham Winery, Doug's, the winery, what, which what? is co-owned by uh, my sister and brother, sister-in-law and brother-in-law. Oh, and Dunham. Wow. What's the name of that? Dunham. Dunham. Oh, so I you love could, Dunham you could, Cellars. Yeah. Yeah. Dunham you could yes. fly in there, and it was great. And we got a car. Margaret came with us, wasn't it, mm-hmm. Margaret? Margaret? Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Five, mm-hmm. five of us. One, two, three. Yeah, yes. five of us mm-hmm. went. And it was a lot of fun. And we went to, we got a car. Uh, a driver, mm-hmm. and we went and visited the wineries. We went downtown. We had lunch. We had dinner. Margaret, we found this taco place. Remember, it was, it was a, a taco truck. Nine <laughs> cents <laughs> taco. And Margaret said, I'll treat best. for dinner. I'll, <laughs> yeah. I'll, I'll, t- I'll pick this up. 59 cent tacos. <laughs> yeah, wasn't it? Something yeah. like that. Yeah. And that. And that was great. And then what was there was a oh, well, we, we originally had planned i think to go to jackson hole mm. and it got it was snowed in mm. oh. so we had to make changes right yeah. at the last minute that's when we went to walla walla because we were looking for somewhere to go right mm. so so the deal was it had to be someplace we could fly and come back in right. one day oh so right. within a days because yeah, i yeah. had mm-hmm. plans for all the days oh <laughs> yeah. Well, yeah they were different i'd go different places and different and i did go uh, a couple of times I went someplace for a couple of days. Mm-hmm. But we went four different times. We went again. We went twice to Canada. We went we again to Victoria. Walla, Walla. We went back to Victoria. And we went back to Victoria. Went to Walla Walla. Um, but so you, you went to Victoria Roberta twice? Roberta to Bozeman. Oh, Roberta. I took to Bozeman because Roberta couldn't go that day for some reason. That's right. Mm-hmm. She, she didn't. I don't know. She didn't go. Mm-hmm. So I took her to Bozeman. Yeah. Yeah. Which was kind of like Victoria. <laughs> <laughs> Just different. But more cows. Not the garden. <laughs> yeah. But more cows. Yeah. Yeah. But she was a, she was a, she was a trooper. She had, she had, and, and she was a, I always, because I am an, an enabler mother, and I always, um, the, the style of Roberta, she was a no yeah. No nonsense. Yeah. Mm-hmm. You mm-hmm. forget it, come back and get it, because I'm not taking it to you. <laughs> you know, or sending it to you. Yeah. Right. Make do till you get yeah. back. And I thought, oh, why couldn't I have been more like that? <laughs> <laughs> why couldn't I have said those yeah. kind yes. of things? Yeah. You know? But she was a great hostess. She and oh, David yes. both. Yes. She, she and David so many things at their property so at Shadow Ridge. Um, uh, and most of them all revolved around community and the arts, mm-hmm. all of them. Um, had a lot of library events there. We yes. had women's groups there. We had um, gosh, the we Democrat, had Democrats. Democrats. Yeah, Democrats yes, there. Democrat, David yeah. was because David was always politics. running for some office. Right. Mm-hmm. Um, so we all supported we had many that. Many events there and yeah. conservation things and yeah. mm-hmm. yes. Yeah, that was a that was a, a was real a spot. Great for fundraising oh, great for spot. thanking people mm-hmm. for mm-hmm. all of that, and also she was on. We were all on the theater board together. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yes. summer theater. Yeah, summer, summer theater, theater for a while, mm-hmm. and she was very involved in that. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah, she she had a great appreciation for art, and yes, I remember her. She was a wonderful mother in that she exposed her children to a lot, mm-hmm. and they learned about art from her. And she was a teacher, mm-hmm. yeah. and so was he. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And uh, I remember meeting Christine for the first time, and she was involved in the arts and living in Seattle. Mm-hmm. And I loved it because she had purple hair <laughs> and, uh, the time, uh, and the little yes. rings and the whole thing, and <laughs> just, you know, the opposite mm. of Roberta, <laughs> right? just the antithesis. She yeah. was what we would have called a hippie right. when back in my day, yeah. and adorable and bright and really talented, mm-hmm. and Roberta and Dave were so supportive of her mm-hmm. and what she wanted to do. But that, I, that was really promoted, and not promoted, but supported by both um, right, because they were not only supporters of the arts, but education in general. Absolutely, mm-hmm. and yes. that was, mm-hmm. you know, just really important. I think. Yeah, yeah. and she contributed so much to all of the um, uh, anything to do with education. Mm-hmm. You know, she was yes. a great supporter. Um, yeah. I know Mary and I were talking about a trip that I don't think you could go, but um, in. Was it 2010? I won the Governor's Award for Support of the Arts. Oh, right. So all of us went down to Boise. Boise. We all flew down to Boise. Roberta Mm -hmm. and Mary and a whole bunch of people came down. Um, Mainly they were folks on the Library Foundation, associated with the Library Library Foundation, Foundation. Mm -hmm. and went to the Egyptian Theater and Mm -hmm. um, stayed downtown Boise and had a great time. We loved downtown Boise. It was beautiful. 
Ruberta oh, was there. It was wonderful, yes. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Ruberta had a great time. We had a great time. Yeah. yeah. That was fun. So and we went to Portland. We Remember, went, we had trips oh, to God. Seattle Portland. and Portland. To and Portland. Seattle. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, went on our own. <laughs> Where? On our own. On our, no, we did, and then... Oh, but Roberta learned how to take <laughs> the train from the airport into yes. town. And I learned. <laughs> well, I did not so we all learned. <laughs> we all learned something on that train. Yes. Especially yes. Yes. Oh, oh, yeah. Pan here. I'm, the, I'm the only one that was ra- raised you were in the big city. You were savvy. I was in there. And then Pan. Pan money. And she's opened the purse. Give I'm like, out. this oh, woman geez. gave us this big story about how she was coming to, from her uh, visit to, from Bellingham. And, of course, I used to live in Bellingham. And I went, oh, where were you? And she she was real vague about it, and I couldn't figure out where. But she had left her purse. She didn't have any money, and her son was. Br- I don't know. So I ended up giving her like whatever I had in my purse. Fifty dollars. Meanwhile, Ellen's sitting over there going, oh, "Are you kidding me?" Go for it. Go but for it. <laughs> I didn't interrupt it. But I it. I just, she was going she like was this. Yeah. Yeah. And, and I hadn't been around a. Pa- I mean, anyone like that. Oh, she was in a good. Long, long I thought time, she was good. You know, mm-hmm. that was very. <laughs> so I paid her for the performance. There you go. <laughs> it was theater. Go. And where was that? that where did we stay? Uh, so was it near in Portland? I want to we say were in Queen a Anne. It wasn't Queen Anne. Was Are we talking about Portland? Portland? In Portland. No, no, I went to Seattle. Seattle. Okay, Seattle. <laughs> we're in Seattle. We mm. stayed at a motel out north. Remember, mm. we took the train out of the airport, and then we took we, a second one. I just remember staying downtown where we got on a trolley and went down and we could go near Oh, we were near, uh, what was the book? Uh, huh? Sweet. Oh, uh, uh, the corner of Bitter and Sweet. Bitter and Sweet. Corner of Bitter and Sweet. We were kind right. of near That's there. Right. Yeah. Mm-hmm. You yes. know, the, the author, he was here. The, uh, J- what's his name? I don't uh, remember. Jane, I'm reading is mm-hmm. Ford. Mm-hmm. Ford. Jamie, Jamie, Jamie Ford. Jamie Ford. Ford. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm-hmm. He was here for one of the... Uh, the um, uh, humanities, the li- oh, okay. humanities, oh, right. yeah, yeah, Co- uh, lectures, yes. mm-hmm. and then we also brought him to the library. Yes, mm-hmm. yeah, yes. and so we we stayed close to there. Yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. and then we walked <laughs> down to Fifth Avenue, and I remember me going to different restaurants. And Sandy Pearson met us when we were in Seattle, yes. and we drove around with Sandy. Yes. We were scared yes. to death, but yeah. it was fun. <laughs> yeah, that was great. And Portland, it poured rain. I remember having the umbrellas. We had umbrellas, and we took the trolley everywhere in Portland yeah. and had a wonderful time. Mm-hmm. Yeah, we did some nice girls' weekends. Yeah, sometimes. it sounds mm-hmm. like just it. take off and go for a couple of days. I want to be your friend. Well, <laughs> kind of like you and <laughs> oh, yeah. Callie yeah. 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 go Callie everywhere. Right. Yes. Yes. We do yeah. have fun, too. Yeah, yeah right. you do. do. It, it, it really is. And when, when we started losing husbands, yeah. uh, it changed. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Well, you were first. Well, mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, and then yeah. Me, I don't know it just seemed to slow. We never we didn't do the well, any of the traveling, and then you found yeah. one. Well, yeah, <laughs> <laughs> we have a lost husband, you know, Mary. We <laughs> found a partner, lives. and yeah. yeah, a little bit, but you yeah. know, mm-hmm. I think we can still travel. We can, <laughs> right? Yeah, we can. Still I'm, do it. I'm up for it. I'd like to go to Seattle. It. We need to go. We should go to Seattle. I'd yes, like well, Seattle. you're really busy with a lot of projects. I am. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I am. I'm going back on to General Hospital. <gasps> wow. I love that. After 30 years. <laughs> oh, my God. Might, they can hear this in the podcast. I'm okay. sure they can. They I'll tell my mother-in-law. That. Roberta, would, <laughs> Roberta would have been <laughs> very Roberta excited. would love it. Oh, she yeah. Would love she it. would, would, would love it. She would yeah. love it. Wait, did we just have some breaking news? On the <laughs> <laughs> I think so. The producer on first ever. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, 30. Yeah, first people. Yeah. 30 <laughs> years ago. 30, yeah, 30 years, years ago. Same yeah. storyline back. <gasps> what character did you play? Because I didn't get to see it. Uh, the, uh, well, we were interesting storyline. Is this okay to talk about? Of yeah, course it absolutely. is. Absolutely. Um, uh, Rena Sofer, who's been on The Bold and the Beautiful yes. and a lot of things for many, you many years. Mom, right? I was her mom on General Hospital. Right. We were the Cirillos. And we were from Brooklyn. Yeah. And uh, usually, Nathan you know, was in it too. the soap operas don't have people from Brooklyn. <laughs> <laughs> you know, they're sort of patrician. Yeah. Rena was in fa- fabulous, and she had the nails out to there, and she was Beautiful. gorgeous yeah. and talk like when she was. So then they cast me as her mother, and we did. I commuted from here. Oh I'd get that God. six wow. o'clock plane and get into LA by 
eight thirty nine, and they'd take me over. At that time, it was Prospect mm-hmm. shoot, but I had a house there then. Mm-hmm. But I did it for about a year and a half. I'd been on ninety four to ninety six. Do you remember when Rena came and yes. did the fundraiser with Wally Kurt? Yes, and I also remember that I was sitting in uh, what's now the vault coffee house, but what it was called mm-hmm. before. Java. 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 And I remember seeing these beautiful people walk in. I go, they're not from here. Because <laughs> I was like, I had the kids in strollers. You know, I had Maddie running around and Jackson in a stroller. And I was like, they're too beautiful. They're, they're not from here. And then I was like, oh, actress. And I was like, oh, and there's Ellen. And then I was like, oh, Nathan Fillon. And then I was like, oh, it was Wait, Rena. Nathan Fillion was here? Yeah, it was Nathan Fillion? was dating. Nathan Fillion was with Rena Sofer that weekend. No, this is another weekend. <laughs> she was married to Wally Kurt. I know. On and off, and then later she came back again. Well, You're thinking the second time with somebody else. She came with Nathan. With Nathan, yeah. yes. So I didn't see the Wally one. You but didn't I, do that, that fundraiser? I didn't the, do that one. You I didn't. Did the, that's I did what she came in the, for. I did the one with all the Travoltas. Oh, that was yeah, different. On the I barge. did the boat. On the, on barge, the barge, right. when the women yeah. were jumping off the barge. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> swimming. <laughs> when Mary won the dance contest and wasn't there. She was in the bathroom. <laughs> okay, that's another story. Yeah, another story. Totally okay. another anyway, story. That, that, that's going to happen. She's that's going fun. back. She wanted me to come back, and they're working it. It's a different contract because we're on strike. Oh, yeah. Um, but it's a, after has a different contract. And oh. when we did that, after and SAG were separate. Now it's SAG after. Oh, but right. they haven't changed that. So they have scab writers that is approved by the Writers Guild, so they um, can go ahead and do it. They were, I guess, they thought if they didn't, it would be the end of daytime. They oh, just yeah. couldn't survive it. Mm-hmm. It's true, yeah. you know. They, yeah, because yeah. it, it's every day. That's but anyhow, so that. How do you watch General Hospital these days? Because it's not on. It's on ABC. ABC. It is on ABC mm-hmm. yeah, still. Never still changed. Oh Six, wow, okay. sixty years. Yeah, yeah, it's, wow. It's 60. that Days wow. of Our Lives and like Young and Restless, and, and that's, that's about, about it. it. I used yeah. to watch that in college. We'd go upstairs where the TV was in our dorm. Yeah. And we'd all get together for General Hospital. Oh, yeah, with that Luke and Laura. Back in the Luke and Luke and Laura. I let Molly stay home from school for the wedding. I well, I have to go to school. No, you stay <laughs> home. <laughs> don't miss it. Oh, say, don't hilarious. miss the wedding. My okay, mother. so you're going to be back on? Yeah. Yeah. That was fun. And what but do you play? I play her mother again. It's the same people. What happened wow. is, see, she, Wally and her, this, this is We'll get back to That's her. That's all right. We'll get, um, <laughs> we'll get back to her. Roberta the, the, would love the, it. Roberta yeah. would have loved this. Yeah. She yeah. would have yeah. asked me a lot of questions. When I went on the show, Rena was on. Rena and Wally played boyfriend and girlfriend. Right. And then they fell in love, got married on the show, and got married in real life. Mm-hmm. Okay? Oh. There, then she had a baby. Then she quit the show. Wally and Wally quit the show. They got divorced. Wally came back to the show. So Wally has been on the show for about 25 more years. Wow. Oh, wow. So now, unfortunately, Wally, his character, has amnesia, and they're bringing... <laughs> That's true. And they're bringing Lois back to wake him up. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. He hasn't died once or twice. Yeah. Yeah, probably, <laughs> yeah, but he's still the same character. Oh. And then along, and she wanted me to come, and she's the one that pitched. She said, That's I want sweet. you back with me. That's and, oh, uh, I love that. Oh, and, oh, and, and I have another very cute story about her. When you receive an Oscar or an Emmy, you are allowed to share that if you feel someone really made your performance when mm-hmm. she won an Emmy. Mm-hmm. She shared it with me. Aww. So I have a picture of an Emmy. <laughs> 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 with really nice wording. Yeah. Uh, she has the Emmy, but she's always, you know, we've always kept in good fr- friends. And yeah. she oh, should I want you to, I haven't been there in 30 years. That's, oh, yeah. Same casting director. I can not oh. believe it. Wow. So anyway, that's going to happen. Job. So are you going to help him come back from an amnesia? I'm sure I'll annoy him. Shock, <laughs> shock him into it. Wake up already. Wake, Wake up. up. Oh, that's great. I love oh, it. So, <laughs> yeah, Roberta would have loved that. Roberta, she she would. Would. Roberta was she great was. fun. Wow. Yeah, she had a wonderful was. sense of humor, and she always wanted to be included in everything. Mm-hmm. She wanted to go and do. and. She was perfect to go have a glass of wine 
Oh, yes. Or Studio three. or three. <laughs> Studio yep. 107. And yep. Just she usually bought the bottle. And bought and the bottle. Yeah, bought the bottle. you ladies like to share a bottle? Yeah. Yeah. Well, okay. All right. <laughs> Twist our arm. I'm going to be into it. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. And she, how long was she, was she always part of arts and culture? Almost mm. always. Yeah. She, she, I don't know exactly. So arts, the Arts and Culture Alliance was formed in 2005 as a committee, and then in mm. 2006 got its nonprofit status. Yes. And, and somewhere after there, Roberta Because I was on then, too, mm-hmm. for a long time. Mm-hmm. Right. And Roberta was on with me. Mm-hmm. Um, but I can't remember. Who was the, who the um, leader of it then? Do you remember? Um well, there were several, uh, but no, I don't know yeah. exactly. I, anyway, it's it was, hard to find the history. I was on for about 10 years, and Roberta was too, and mm-hmm. then she stayed on after yeah, I... Yeah, right. And then she was the chair when I came okay. on mm-hmm. to the board. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I think she served as a chair a couple of times, but yeah. I'm not positive about yeah. that. Yeah. And she was always sponsoring concerts, with, yeah. mm-hmm. always yeah. with either Otis. Malcolm or Malcolm Otis. Or Otis, Otis. Mm-hmm. yes. Her yeah. lovely dog. And the last few years, she'd sponsor a concert by her. It was Roberta and Otis. Yes. And Christine did the painting of Otis. That was her ad. Yeah. In the yes. in the program. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so sweet. She won uh, Volunteer of the Year when I don't, while we were walking in Friends. Oh. She for did. The mayor volunteer, volunteer of the Year in general. They have a oh. award that they give for a person who Through the volunteers. Chamber. Yeah. Mayor. Oh, the okay. mayor? Mm-hmm. Mayor's Arts Awards? No. No, no, no. it's a separate thing. It's, oh. it's, yeah. a volu- it's someone who... It's, I think, the annual chamber dinner or something. They do, okay. uh, they do honor a volunteer of the yeah. year. Oh. But speaking of awards, she is... She did win the Mayor's Awards in the Arts as a supporter of the arts years ago. Yes. Mm-hmm. But um, just the other day, yes. she got... Lifetime Achievement yes. Award, yeah. mm-hmm. which has yes. only been awarded twice. One, the first time was to Steve Gibbs, mm-hmm. and and then Roberta gets. Yeah, yeah. That's, wow. great. that's great. That's great. Yes, yeah. yes. That's a very prestigious group. Yes, it is. and that's that's a, that's a lovely thing, and and that that's a good for her. Yeah. Yes, I like that yeah. for her. Yeah, mm-hmm. she was a character. Mm-hmm. For sure, she was a character. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm-hmm. She, she truly we was certainly I, re- really quite sure what she was going to come out of her what, mouth. <laughs> we had good <laughs> luck with Roberta. Uh, <laughs> and what? Do you remember playing catchphrase with Roberta? Oh, oh my God. Jeez. <laughs> oh, yeah. Give her a glass of wine and start a game. <laughs> yeah. Oh, my gosh. Remember at the float house? Oh, <laughs> and the float house. We, go, we used to go to the float house for the weekend, and we'd get there and have a couple have just a boat like a, and have a, a drink, drink or yeah. so, and mm-hmm. it's timed, right? And yeah. maybe the, the word was, yeah. I don't know, let's say blue, mm-hmm. just for blue. Well, it is, it is uh, when you look up and the tick, 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 you're walking <laughs> down the street, <laughs> very big tick, 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 mm-hmm. and there you're looking, you're seeing, and you're wondering, and you're going to say, blue, it's blue. <laughs> But she would, she had to paint the picture. Yeah, yeah. she oh she had to set gosh. the scene and mm-hmm. paint. The, yeah, she oh. couldn't just Say give you simple clues. Yeah. You know, you're no. waiting so anxiously, and it wasn't simple clues. No, it was it was setting the scene. It, it was, was and telling with competitive a story. People it didn't go well. <laughs> no, no. <laughs> you know, they they didn't like that. So. <laughs> on my team. No. Gosh, I remember <laughs> that. Oh, Roberta and the games. Yes. Mm-hmm. Oh, fun. She did do well with games. In the, next door in the board meetings. And just she oh, watching just, her roll her eyes. Oh, yeah. Of our board yeah. members. Non stop. It was oh, just man. like, <laughs> me laugh so many well, times. Well, you know, and she frequently just. <laughs> She didn't have a lot of filters. No, no, so, right? <laughs> she, None. That's so we would be it. places, and you know, a person might be sitting like just two right. feet in front of you. Yes. And she'd say, "Is that the ugliest hat you've ever seen?" <laughs> <laughs> and I'm like, Roberta, the person is right here. I think we can hear you. Uh, yeah. She's like, "Well, it is. It's the ugliest hat I've ever seen." <laughs> That's true. Yeah. Or when she wanted a glass of wine and she oh, had yes. no hesitation to break into the front of the line and say I'm an old lady I need a glass old of wine here. <laughs> <laughs> that's true I got a good one. Oh yeah yeah Chris. Okay. my favorite story of Roberta was 
like either my second or th second or third year on the board for arts and culture and we were having one of our events our member events at 315 and i was late because um i couldn't get ready fast enough and i get to the <laughs> so this was oh, yeah. this was like six years ago and i get to the get to the event and i'm, I'm just like God, i'm so hot what the hell and she goes kristen you're having a hot flash <laughs> and i'm like <laughs> what <laughs> i'm like that's what this is she's like yeah that's a hot flash and i'm like she goes and it gets worse <laughs> you're gonna have so much fun yeah. Yeah. tell it yeah. like it is tell it like it is tell it like it is that's yeah. right i used to call her every once in a while and say okay roberta let's go out to lunch and usually we'd meet at 107 but occasionally we'd go to vine and olive and the last time we went to vine and olive um, we had a really, I'd, I picked her up, we went to Vine and all, we went back to her house. She clearly did not want me to leave. Mm -hmm. So she said, I have wine in the refrigerator. Yeah. <laughs> and, and I said, okay, just one glass. Well, it turned into a bottle and a half. Mm -hmm. wow. And I was there for four hours and we talked about just about everything. And every time I'd get up to say, I really have to go now. She'd go. Oh, but something else came yeah, up, and yeah, yeah. It yeah I think I think that she was. Um, she didn't want to go anywhere. She wanted people mm -hmm. to come come to her. To her. There. We went and there yeah. all during COVID. Yes, that's you good. know, so we could sit six feet apart in her yeah. yard. Mm -hmm. Yeah, um, for coffee in the morning and wine in the afternoon, mm -hmm. and because yes. it was our only you know yeah. ability to socialize with each other. Well, so. you you guys were way. Uh, I the last few years I just haven't been around a lot. I would call, leave a message, and she most of the time didn't get back. I saw her a couple of times, but mm -hmm. not like years before. Mm -hmm. and right. I, but I think that she had the pup, and then when Christine would come, but she she really wanted company. Mm -hmm. we, we all shared the same uh, cleaning lady, mm -hmm. and she'd like. Wendy to yes. finish early. Aren't yes, you done yes. yet? Is it that dirty? How about finish the house? <laughs> she, you should be, because you want to sit and have wine with Wendy. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> Wendy would bring her lunch uh, after she was done and have lunch with Roberta, and she loves that. Yeah. Oh, and, that, that and, then, and they would talk and talk to her. So I think she wanted to mm -hmm. one on one talking. She yeah. wasn't interested in events anymore no. or anything like that. Mm -hmm. Yeah. You know, and I think also. She got very comfortable in that setting and mm -hmm. really didn't want to be gone from there. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Because yeah. that setting is uh, where, didn't she grow up in She was born house? there. She, she was, was born raised, in that house. Leave, She yes. was born there. Yep. Was, and her family's had that in there. In, in the, it's in, been in the family for yes, a right. very long Way time. Way over 100 years. Right. Mm -hmm. yeah. Yeah. Yeah, which is really I think unusual for this area to have especially lakefront property that and has as much of it right as they that and it's family. lovely. It is yeah. it is. It really oh, is. It's, it's, it's so a, special. It's a wonderful, wonderful yeah. place and that yeah. yeah, I will miss it won't ever be it was it you know, was always lovely because she was there. Mm -hmm. You know, and there's something about that view and where that place is that yeah. is yeah. is terrific. But I, I really believe that um, she was finished. Mm -hmm. She yeah. was done. I think yeah. she really just, yeah. Yeah. she was ready to and move she on. went the way she wanted to go. Yeah. Boy, yeah. she, she did. did. She yeah. stayed yeah. home yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. where she wanted to be. Up and, yeah. 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 But she was uh, quite, quite a lady. Yeah. She was quite a lady. Yeah. She probably would say she wasn't a lady. <laughs> <laughs> she might sing, the lady is a tramp. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. But she had a good time. Yeah, yeah she did. did. She enjoyed was, it all. Yeah, that was the most important thing. And yeah. I think we're all just so fortunate to have known her and been close to her over the years. In written yes. Yeah, mm -hmm. for sure. Yes. My mother loved her, too. It was really fun to take my mom to her place. We'd go um, do something at Roberta's just about every time mom would come. Mm -hmm. Yeah. She's just super fun, loving, feisty. Yep. Feisty little old lady. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. And a great, great supporter yep. of the arts and education, mm -hmm. and the environment. She was a great citizen. She was. Sure. A great exactly. Citizen. Yes. Yep. And if, and if she liked you, Everything was fine. <laughs> <laughs> and if she didn't, don't get on her bad side. I guess she kind of knew it. Yeah. yeah. Yes. She kind of knew it. 
too kind of yeah. Idea. yeah. I think on that note, yeah. we um, really appreciate you guys coming in and sharing these stories. They're just so fun. Yeah. And we we did good time. We did. Yeah. Oh, yeah. We did great. Yeah. Perfect. Okay. So uh, thank you so much well, for coming. Well, you're in. all wonderful diamonds in this beautiful little city of ours. Yes. Yep. We're so lucky to have you all here. And uh, and just to just a reminder that Roberta um, won a lifetime achievement award at the Mayor's Awards in the Arts this year. Thank you again, ladies. This was really nice. Yes, thank, thank you. you. Well, thank you. Great fun. Yes. Yeah. Thanks we for love inviting us. Great stories. Fine. Yep. So many more. And we appreciate all three of you too, yes, because all you. three of you are great supporters of arts and education and. The Library Foundation yes. and reading books and musicians, actors, travel, doctor. Yep. Uh, be sure to tune in to General Hospital soon. Ooh. Yes. It, 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 she it may play a doctor. Soon. I can't say when it is yet, but yeah. it's maybe next. Oh, I don't, I'll know when I get back. I don't know yet. Okay. When I do it and when it airs are a different time. Okay. But yes. Right. Yep. That'll be fun. Yep. Yeah. It will be fun. So. so I'm Allie. And I'm Callie. And whatever you do today... Make sure it's creative. And make sure that you're making a difference in your community. Like Roberta. Like Roberta. Yes. Or be the Allie and Kelly like Artcast is a program of the Coeur d'Alene Arts and Culture Alliance and is sponsored by NIA, North Idaho Alliance, a woman based leadership organization designed to inspire, uplift, and impact your community and lives. And Tubbs Coffee Roasters, globally sourced, locally roasted coffee. Thank you.